Hey everyone, I'm back again for Marvel Spider-Man. Um, obviously, as part of the uh, DLC pack, the city that never the city that never sleeps, and this is obviously DLC number three, um, the Silver Lining, or just Silver Lining even. Uh, <laughs> obviously, after I le left off yesterday, finishing off these, or well, finish off that Olympus hideout, which took forever <laughs> I finally did finish it off uh, obviously now I'm just about to start off the um, the the side mission that came out right afterwards uh, hopefully I won't take me forever this time uh, and then that just really leaves well at least two locked something because I obviously don't know what they are yet because I've got two here two here Two here, but then another, uh, another it was two there for for one, and then something else for like uh, at one. So I don't know till a little later anyway. But let's get on with this side mission, and then obviously I go back to the normal story mission, rescuing Sable. You might be able to hear the background of my laptop. I've got it on at the moment. Um, not doing anything important, just. I had it on to look up something and I forgot to turn it off, but it's fine, but you just might be able to hear the fan in the background. So, um, if you can hear it, I apologise. If you can't, never mind. Nope, fuck it. Hopefully my microphone's been on. He says. There's David. He's in trouble. Gotta move. Hi, David. You look like you could use a little help. I just jump. Oh wow, I right. gave me my ass beat. Trust me. Jeez. Oh, it's one of you, you prick. so hard too. I can't see for the fucking tree. That's bullshit. I wish they wouldn't take so long to go down. 
they won't be near this half as fun, obviously. You okay? I think so. Thank God for this sable armor. So, what's next? Deliver the caches to the Simkarian embassy. Thanks to you, the Simkarians will finally get the aid they need. Just happy I could help. But I meant what's next for you. Well, a few minutes ago, I received a call from a school in Midtown. Uh. They offered me a visa if I accepted a teaching position. I don't suppose you had something to do with that. Good things happen to good people. I can't thank you enough. I will try every day to help my students achieve their dreams as you have helped me achieve mine. Actually, I should be the one thanking you. For what? For reminding me why I'll always love this city. Is that it? Please tell me that's it. I don't really want to chase up a hop of the van if it gets... Ah, is it me? Or is the world a little brighter right now? Okay, we're good. I'm just gonna bask in this good feeling for at least the next few seconds. Or until something else bad happens. I David's gonna be one of those cool teachers whose classes are packed. Okay, I'm not sure what's going on. Went to black. Well, hopefully that's fixed it. I'm not sure what happened there. Oh, hang on. This is it, folks. This is the big one. <laughs> I finally have Okay, proof. it's the same... Uh... For years, I have asked my dear listeners to send in photographic evidence to prove once and for all that Spider-Man is directly linked to the very criminals who plague our city. And finally, finally, one brave anonymous caller has delivered the goods. We have clear photos of Spider-Man standing in the immediate vicinity of caches of humanitarian aid. Aid that was intended for Simkari. And our heroic caller assures me that these very humanitarian caches are being sold on the black market. If I've learned one thing in my years as a world-renowned reporter, it's this. Photos don't lie. Spider-Man has the been red-handed. No pun intended, puns are for whips. So what do we do about it, you ask? We wait. We wait for the police to finally wake up and arrest this mass lunatic. Long last, this city is going to finally see that Jameson has been right about Spider-Man this entire time. Not only is he a thief, he's actually stealing vital food and medicine from innocent civilians who are trapped in a war zone. Women and children struggling to survive. Hiding each day from a hail of mortars and bullets. Meanwhile, Spider-Man is stealing the very aid that might keep them alive. This is a new low, people. Even I could never have suspected Spider-Man of something this despicable. All we can do now as a city is to sit back and quietly reflect on just how right J. Jonah Jameson really was. Yet again. Uh-huh. I'm not sure you've got the facts there, sir. Well, unless, um, that Sable, ex-Sable agent was playing me, which is just entirely possible in this universe context. Uh... I'm gonna hope, assume, he wasn't. Uh, so how long have I got? About half an hour. Yeah, so obviously, I... I'm not sure what happened, but obviously went to black screen that that just the facts audio played and that was it. Obviously I couldn't see what was going on. But now obviously I've reset <laughs> not restarted, but I just quit and reopened it. The it seems hideout it must be somewhere close by. It seems to be working now, so we are I'm not sure what happened, why it did that. But at least we are now able to actually do something huh, must be underground guess it's time for some urban spelunking it's basically the same as the other ones so 
that I ended up having to stitch those two videos together now. Which won't take me that long. I'm sure, in fact, once this goes up on YouTube, it already smell. will be, uh, Fuck. it will be stitched together. If I can get through this without getting wet, that'd be a win. Well, I mean, technically you're already wet. Hello! This is so cool. Why would you yell? Your child's... Oh, look at this place. The amount of work it takes to make this city run is just crazy. I'll never take fresh water for granted again. You mean you shouldn't in the first place? Okay, let's see where this leads. Looks like some loose bricks up ahead. Nice. Okay, onward. Hammerheads, guys. They've taken over an abandoned subway platform. Gotta take these guys out, then look around for Sable. And smack. As long as this isn't a, uh, what's it called? I oh, we fine. Having to deal with waves. I mean, I don't want to deal with waves again. Phone vibrating. Oh, hang on. One thing I've got to do. Suits. Another guy there as well. Don't think I can get in closer to weapon up, so I'll have to do that. Hello, I didn't even see you before. Or you either. Is here. Just those three? That's fine by me if it's just those three.
Nothing. I thought maybe that would get them. that was technically safe, let's just do all that now then. We're patrolling, but I do have notes. Okay, that's all of them. Oh now, good. I bet if I follow the power cables I'll find where they're holding Sable. Follow the power cables. Well, that doesn't seem too safe. Looks like they've jacked into the subway's power line somehow. Hope that's not a load bearing subway car. Follow the yellow wire. Better not find any lions, tigers, or oh, bears. Oh, I was just about to make that oh joke. My. Ah, tunnel's blocked. But I think I can still squeeze through. I'd just be careful if I was you. Because that's what on an electric line. Cable, even. I know what the best scientist in the world, or actually a scientist, but water and electricity seems like a bad mix. Do I actually have to swim for this? Oh, it looks like I have to swim for this. Body bags. Oh. This just took a turn. Oh, this one. What do you mean what happened? He died inside the thing, like the other guys. Who was it? Don't remember his name. Sal's cousin, I think. Was it messy? Nah, he just came out all blue. I think he stopped. It, huh? That's a pigeon. It's gonna be a dead pigeon. Gotta do this quick, and then find Sable. What the? When there was only one set of footprints, that's when I webbed you up. Ah, oh, there are more people. Okay, that wasn't giving me the option to do a what that time? that's fine Is that it? this place looks like their main base of operations sable jetpacks I'd pay good money to see hammerheads guys learning to fly in these things for the first time Project Olympus. These pods require a lot of electricity. Must be why they're leeching off the subway. I told you, I just helped manufacture these things. I didn't design them. Guess we got the wrong guy then. On the bright side, now we got our first test subject. No! No! Don't! Don't turn it on! Please! Just give me a few minutes. I can figure it out. Now that's what I like to hear. Well, this is obviously to deal with um, Harry's disease, so it's got to be a curative thing. 
What it is, I have no idea. So probably remove that. I should have a look around, see what I can learn. Wow. If Hammerhead gets his hands on this thing, we're in serious trouble. Basically explains why it's just the head now. All this stuff belongs to Sable. Yeah, most of it's overseas though. What do you think of boss? I'm thinking about how she took over the whole city in a matter of days. You mean back during that devil's breath thing? Yeah, that was crazy. Not so crazy when you got the right equipment. Well, we got those digging things. Not good enough. If we want the best stuff, we're gonna need her. Yeah, okay. How are we gonna do that? Just keep taking her stuff. She'll come to us. XRT-89, Subterranean Troop Deployment Vehicle. That's the real name? <laughs> I'm sticking with Dig Boy. That sounds like a screen. Sable, sounds like she's close. There. The only way out is through. Yeah. Voltage wires and sewer water. What could possibly go wrong? If there's one takeaway from this underground lair thing, it's that Hammerhead should have fewer thugs with guns and a lot more safety inspectors. back for me of course that's what frenemies are for because I need you I work alone I used to say the same thing I know what's happening in Simcaria I know why this means so much to you I think you know but you do not know what can I do to make you trust me look I think I know how we can take down that monster but I can't do it alone Damn it! He let her loose! Okay, here's the plan. Good plan.
fight banter, though. Come on, come on. Hey Sable, where did you learn to fight? On the street with Simcaria. Yeah? I learned from watching movies. We should compare notes. I'm stuck! God damn. Hey Sable, no lethal force, okay? I'm not against using lethal force if I'm honest. Most of these guys, if I'm honest, are beyond saving. I'm under the I'm always under the impression most people can be saved, but some of these guys, especially Habad, they can't be saved. They are always going to be the sh piece of shit they are. So, you know what? If they get killed, I don't care. You must teach me how to use them. I wish I could, but it's a whole big intellectual property thing. A dig boy, of course. Did you say dig boy? Yeah. Way better than the real name, don't you think? Oh, Jesus. God damn it. This is definitely a tough fight. Okay, I need drones. Jeez. Oh, I thought that was. Oh, is that it? That's it. That's fine. That's cool. That was awesome. High five. Oh. You said you could defeat Hammerhead. You, uh, know you left me hanging, right? There are medical records in here. Yeah, mostly about that metal plate in his head. Carbon steel. Super strong, pretty sensitive to... Heat! Have an idea. I uh, solemnly swear to uh, do whatever you tell me to. I will call soon. Ow. But I like that. Yeah. <laughs> Go do is I'm gonna stop this recording, stitch the two bits together, and then upload that to YouTube in a second. Not that you would know, because hopefully when it's on YouTube, it's already gonna be one one video already. I guess I'll do some spidey work while I wait for Sable's call. Hey, what's that? What is that? What's with all the yellow stuff? Hmm. Is this some weird street artist thing? You know what though? Just gonna have to wait for the next video. Till then, 
Bye for now.